I did have a migraine earlier. Guys, my migraine totally won today. Thought I was gonna be able to beat it. You did though, cause you're out. Yeah, what? that's true. But like, my normal workload during the day. We're going this way? Yeah, she took some naps with Eve. No, Eve was not involved. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was able to get the vlog out and do some button stuff, but then I like literally just, I thought I was like getting delirious and scary, so. I took a nap, and then I woke up like right when Peter got home, and feel good enough to just come to the wilderness lodge and relax. But we are disappointed. Yeah, I heard that there was the Christmas stuff up, like the Christmas tree at Wilderness Lodge, and they've got a big one. And it's our favorite resort. It is our favorite resort, and it's not here. So we may take the boat to the Polynesian because someone on Twitter or Reddit or Instagram or somewhere told me today that they heard the Polynesian tree is up. It's like 70 degrees. I'm ready for. Sunny and breezy. What am I ready for? You're ready for a Florida winter, which is what this is. No, what is that like slam poetry reading? Oh, yeah. <laughs> so we're leaving Wilderness Lodge. It was a very quick trip. Now we're going to come back later, but we're going to take the boat to Contemporary because there's no Christmas stuff here. And in about 40 minutes, if we're lucky, we're going to catch um, a rocket launch out of Cape Canaveral. It's our favorite pool. It is our favorite pool. Look. Woo! Look at look at my backpack. <laughs> this is He's crooked. That's what I just explained that you had your surgery. Yeah, that is. So Peter's a little crooked, so that's why his backpack is always falling off. If up. you ever see me in the parks, I'm not a slug because my shoulders are crooked and sometimes I forget to fix it. Because it's every five minutes. Also, this even though this is a turtleneck, it's very, very, very thin. So don't think I'm a sissy. I really hope there's no spiders. Oh, why just to remind me? You need to be prepared. Okay, I'm strong. Hope for the best, prepare for I'm the worst. I'm strong like a lion. You're brave like a cheetah. Yeah. Oh my god, guys, we're being swarmed. Literally, they ruined us. The forecast number was warning us that these, I forgot what they're called. What are they called? They're like biteless mosquitoes. Biteless mosquitoes that are born in the water and they literally just swarm. We're sitting on like 100 right now. These boats <laughs> from Wilderness Lodge of Polaris have not been good. Last time it was the spiders. We were swarming this I think it's now. just the time of year. Yeah. I think it's cool. Reminds me of a horror movie. It's just nature. <laughs> we're at the Wilderness Lodge for a reason, right? Look at that beauty right there. So we just keep getting curveballs tonight. Literally got off the boat and it was an amazing boat ride because the cast was just singing Christmas carols the whole time because we were covered in bugs. But right as we got off, I was like, you know what? The launch is supposed to happen in 10 minutes. I'm gonna check SpaceX's Twitter. And yes, I did this trip. <laughs> and I literally like 10 minutes ago, SpaceX tweeted that they will not be doing the launch tonight, that they have the pad reserved through tomorrow and they may do it tomorrow, but they might not. They're gonna review some data or whatever, blah, blah, blah. It's not happening. So that was kind of our plan for here. So we're gonna see if there's any Christmas stuff at Contemporary. And as a last ditch, last ditch effort, last stitch effort, <laughs> we will go to the Polynesian to see the tree because I have good on good faith that that tree is up. Look up behind me. I got these beautiful buildings. This is like a glamour shot. Glamour, glamour, glamour. The Contemporary looks extra good right now. I think it's like, the walk leading up to her. Agreed? Do you agree, disagree, or are you uncertain? <laughs> we will explain that story one day. We'll explain it tonight. We have two stories for you. One involves donating plasma, and one involves our marriage, what's that called? Preparation. Preparation, AKA Precana. Precana. So, to give you context, we just walked into the best part of Wait. Tangled. You just, you just punched the camera. You walked up. <laughs> Coffee? 
<laughs> you look, my favorite part. You look at Toddler and Tiara right now. <laughs> Looking at her mom off stage to look at the choreography. She just did this. Let's go see if the tree's here. <laughs> All right, strike two or strike three? I don't know what strike this is. This is two and a half. Why this is, is there half? The bugs. Oh, just thought the Christmas the bugs okay. were nature. Strike two on the Christmas hunt. Um, are we just early? No, I, we're hearing like all like half of the other resorts are ready, and like we know the Contemporary has their their gingerbread because up because we were, saw the gingerbread the other day. We've made it, and I see Christmas decorations. But that doesn't mean a tree yet, Sarah. Oh, I see a little tree. I see one little tree over there. Is it supposed to be a big tree down here? I don't know if it's supposed to be a big tree or a little tree. Oh, I see it. I didn't show it yet. Let's do a, let's do a little reveal. Christmas time is sweats. here. These what? They're called sweats. Are they? We got Christmas all over the front desk. We got Christmas all at home. And wait for it, wait for it. The tree is here. Look at that. Not the biggest, not the littlest, just right. Yep. There's Trader Sam's for you. Please seat yourself. Okay. So we went in there to check out their Christmas menu and they have some Christmas decorations in there as well. Their projections actually had it snowing by a volcano. Go figure. I'm wondering if this menu has the Christmas menu. Yeah. There were three options. Two alcoholic, not uh, one. Not it's not alcoholic. It was called Poinsettia Punch. Poinsettia Punch. It's Poinsettia. Poinsettia Punch. The other one was... Tropical snowstorm. Tropical snowstorm with Jack Daniels and the non-alcoholic one. She didn't tell us because apparently she didn't think we were gonna buy them. <laughs> she said, "Do you have kids?" We yeah. said, "No." And that was it. So we don't know what the third one is. So sorry, we'll find out eventually. Yeah, there's an outside part that usually has seating available. It's this whole big area. But now because it's like a Thursday night in November, inside was pretty dead too. I wanna go. No fancy menu around here? No Christmas menu around here? We'll come soon. Do you just love a good swing? <laughs> I love a good swing, but I always slip and slide off this one. R.I.P. the hammocks on the beach. No, <laughs> just for the season. Maybe they'll come <laughs> back. <laughs> Maybe they'll come back. Maybe they'll come back. This girl's trying to get to me. I tell her to, I'm trying to I be nice, feet. and I'm like, put your legs up here so we can be comfy, so she can be comfy and so I can be warm, because I'm cold. <laughs> she kicks my candy cane after she just got her shoes covered in sand. I'm so, I can't see this. It's sand. sandy claws. I'm certain there's sand on it. Yep, there's sand on my candy <laughs> That's awesome. One day we're gonna do that. That's the luau, the spirit of aloha. It's like every night. Um, we're just like peasants out here. Yeah, like. Please, scratching at the door. Please, yeah. please. We're making our way back to Wilderness Lodge now. The Should we way. tell our two stories now um, that we have some yes. light? Um, I donated blood today at work, and they, without even telling me, like set me up to donate plasma. They like didn't ask him, he just heard them like chattering. No, like, I was already it. set up like, I was waiting to get like the needle stuck in my arm and everything. And all of a sudden I heard the two women talking and I hear the word plasma. I'm like, wait a minute, did you sign up to donate plasma? And like, I used to donate all the time back in Chicago. I used to go like every nine or 10 weeks. Like it's, you're supposed to wait eight weeks. I'd go like every, every like two months, a little over. And so I was like, I'm, I'm used to it. I'm not scared by it. I'm very used to the procedure and everything. And I've never donated plasma before because I know it's a little bit more strenuous on you. It's a longer process. And she's like, yeah, you said you have time. And I was like, yeah, I got time to donate blood, but if you didn't give me a warning, I mean, I still did donate plasma. But he was at work. But I was at work. And then all of a sudden, like, a 20 minute process is now like a 50 minute process. It was weird because just look up what happens when you donate plasma. I don't want to say just that there's queasy, queasy watchers, but it was still cool. I donated plasma. So that was my story for the day. What was the other one? 
The other one, let me think about it. What are we gonna get? We're taking a break. The trees on here, they said it's gonna be here on the 20th. It has chocolate on the back. But we took a break for 9.58. A break for a brick. A break it's for a, a shingle. shingle. <laughs> so this is a shingle. You can actually buy shingles of the gingerbread house. Um, they, they pulled this off, right off this morning. That's and they coated okay. the back with, with chocolate. It's actually the cement that keeps it on get that there's the house. Chocolate on it. So 9.58 for a shingle. We're just gonna enjoy the bands. Oh my gosh, I atmosphere. thought that I was here almost nine years ago. I came on a surprise Christmas trip for the first time for Christmas. It was like literally 11 days after Peter and I started dating. And it was she his birthday. Peace. And my Happy dad birthday. literally, it was like, we had all these plans for his birthday. And I got surprised with a trip to Disney. I didn't get and to go. And I literally cried. How big of a brat was I? Okay, they're starting the music. We're gonna eat. There's a gingerbread shingle. and white. What flavor did you get? Did you go with? Laughter. Is it gonna put you to sleep even though we have to go home and work? Sorry. We haven't seen the piano player here in a long time. I don't know, where is he hiding? I don't know. On the vacation. In the lighting will minutes, be reduced. The lighting will be reduced. We could stay here in 10 minutes the fireworks show is going on and we could watch it. Could we? see it from back here. What? I said, oh, could we? We could. I kind of want to, but I kind of don't. I'm hoping that we get on the, bu the boat to Wilderness Lodge and they just stop. Yeah. In Should we just try for that? Let's just hope for it. Just flew past the camera so fast. Freaking bats. <laughs> I love Halloween. There were just like seven. <laughs> to watch the to watch the, the fireworks. <laughs> you can hear them. Well, I just look this way. No. <laughs> well, now that we just got done being attacked by bats, and we're back at our car, we still got these wonderful fireworks going on. <laughs> there the fireworks are, the perimeters, look at those. Oh my god, those perimeter fireworks. Still going. You still need to work at a new goal, and that is to see perimeter fireworks. They don't happen often. They do them for the Halloween fireworks, they do them for the Christmas fireworks, and they do them for New Year's. New Year's. And I don't think they do them for 4th, 4th of July. July. Or let us know down below. We've actually never seen 4th of July fireworks. I have. Sarah has, but she doesn't remember. I went to Epcot, though. So let us know down below if they put if they do it Magic was the Kingdom. Day my dad saved that woman's life, but <laughs> yeah. I don't believe that story for, for another day. It's for another day. But let us know down below if you've seen Fourth of July and if they're they're Magic Kingdom perimeter fireworks. But perimeter fireworks are incredibly incredible. 
Do we look tired? <laughs> but tomorrow's Friday. And it's kind of like the end of like the week week, kind of. Yeah. Because for me, like, we're doing Fantasmic Friday tomorrow. Booyah. Which we haven't in a while, so we're calm. Saturday is Dapper Day Dapper. at Magic Kingdom, and we've never done it before. So it'll be so much fun for us to do. We were just getting parts of our outfits organized tonight. And then uh, Sunday, we're probably gonna do Epcot to see the holiday around the world. I know Dapper Day is gonna be at Epcot on Sunday, but we're not gonna probably dress up. We'll see. They just might not be as As intense. jazzed up as intense. So that's, that's my hat for Saturday. And then Monday, I go back to the office for like a normal day, but it's like the last normal day, but I know like half the office is gonna be out. And Tuesday is when we go back to Chicago, but I'm actually going to work until like noon or one. But like nobody's gonna be there besides me for the half of the day. Yeah. And then we're gonna I'll come home, we'll get the stuff ready, get the dog situated at Best Friends, and fly off to Chicago. And we are gonna vlog while we're in Chicago, don't worry. Yeah. We've got a hundred and like thirteen or fourteen days strong. We're not gonna stop now just because we're going to Chicago. Nope. Thank you for following along. Get excited for the weekend and the next week because we're gonna have a lot of fun stuff yeah. to show you. We have a surprise on Saturday to. for us that we don't want to tell you yet until we show you. Mm -hmm. But it's been something we've never done before. And with that, it's, it's good, good to, to be, be home. home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.